Good evening, everyone. Good night, teacher. Hello, hello good, teacher. good evening. Good evening, Sandra. Asalia and Mayra, hello, everyone. How are you? I am fine. Thank you for asking. I am okay. Yes. Happy every day. <laughs> and how You're about the happy teacher? The blur. I'm se sorry. Temblor? ¿Cómo se dice temblor? Earthquake. 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 Earth. How okay. about the earthquake? I was sleeping. Yeah. I was sleeping. Really? Yes, I was sleeping. <laughs> okay. Yes. I was sleeping, but and the, the earthquake woke me up. Me despertó, sí, yes. It woke me up, and uh, I ran I ran outside. I ran outside, yes, with my baby. It was, it was uh, bad. Estuvo fuerte, estuvo fuerte el temblor. Sí, aquí se sintió bastante fuerte. Así se cae todo, todo se movía. Yes. But it's okay. Yes. De seis y algo fue. 6.8, según eh, tengo, he leído. Yes. Sí. 6.8. Ya no estamos para eso. <ríe> yeah, we not. No, no, no. Sí. Estaba, estaba un poco dormido, esa, esa abuela que tembló. Un poco, estaba entre dormido y despierto. Entre aquel mundo y este mundo, entonces. <ríe> yes. Sí. But it's. it's... Yeah. Okay. Tell me, people, how, how is everything? How are you? How are you? Tell me. Tell me. Fine. I am exhausted, teacher. Exhausted. So Jorge is okay. Why exhausted? It's Tuesday. It's Martes. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it was a very hard, uh, a very hard uh, Tuesday. Exhausting Tuesday. Yes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear that, people. Yes. Well, we're home. You are home and uh, you're resting. What kind of resting? Yes. Don't worry. Don't worry. We're almost in vacation on vacation. So we're almost there. We just have to wait 12 days. 12 days and we'll be there. All right. People, thank you for coming. Uh, and uh, let me start. Let me begin. And I'm gonna ask you a question. I'm gonna ask you a question. No, I'm not going to ask you a question. I'm going to give you a verb. We're going to practice. This is the last the, the last time we practice or review simple past. I'm going to give you the verb, and you're going to give me the past form of that verb. All right. Are you ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, excellent. I'm going to be I'm, I'm going to be giving everyone individually a verb, and you're going to tell me the past form of that verb. Let's begin with uh, let me see. Uh, Raquel, are you available? Raquel Elizabeth. Okay, so you just oriented at the beginning of her name, so we don't know. All right, let's begin with you, Ismael. Yes. Good evening, teacher. Sorry, I don't hear the. It's okay. I'm, I'm going to tell you. Don't worry. Yes, I'm going to give you the verb. You give me the past form. That's it. Oh, okay, okay. Yes, the verb is touch. 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 Yes, touch. Touched. Okay, touched. With T at the end, touched is the T. past form. Yes, yes. Sandra, hello. Stop. Hello, teacher. Stop. Will you repeat, teacher, please? Stop. Stop. Stop the verb. Stop. 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 Ah. Oh. Stop it. Stop. Stop. With, with T, with T, stopped. Stopped. Okay, okay. Uh, and it's stop. 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 
is that that applies to all verbs. Every every verb that starts with s, the pronunciation is not s. The pronunciation is stop. That starts with s. Stop. Okay, stop. stop. Look at this one. Student. Okay, it is not a student. A student, no. S student. All right. Another example. Special. Special. All right. Keep that in mind. All right. Don't forget about it. It's important to note. All right. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Let me continue with uh, Melanie. Yes, teacher. Good evening. Okay. Your your verb is watch. 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 Yes, watch. Watch. Okay. Yes, exactly. Watched. Watched. Watched is the past form. Denise. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Hello. Your, your, your verb is speak. Speak. I'm sorry? Speak. Spoke. Okay, spoke, exactly. Spoke. Hey, listen, S speak, speak, right? Spoke. Excellent, excellent. Thank you. Let's continue. Jorge. Hi. Hi. Okay. Yes, greet. Greet. I'm sorry, can you repeat? Please. Greet. The verb is greet. Go to the chat. You see, you see it there. Greet. A like greeting. Um. I'm sorry. I I don't know. Let what me is see. What is greet? I guess I guess greet. No, here. Wow, the people. I cannot believe you. Saludar. Greeting. Greeting. Yes, like greeting. greeting, greeting, exactly. Greeting. Yes. It's a verb. It's a verb. It means greet. Saludar. Decirle a alguien hola o buenos días. Right. Hi. Uh -huh. Bye bye. Good morning. Uh -huh. Exactly. Yes, that's greeting. Right. Greet. And the past form is greeted. With ED, greeted. 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 Exactly. Yeah. All right. Let me give you another one. For her. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. Another one. That one is, oh, drink. Easy. Drink. Jorge, drink. <laughs> I'm sorry. Greed. No, drink. Drink. Drunk. Okay, drank, exactly, drank. Muy bien, excellent. Uh, let me continue real quick. Diana? Hello, teacher. Participate, participate. Give, um, me, give me the verb participate in the past form. Uh, Become. Participate, yes. Okay, become. Okay. Yes, the it's past form is... The past I form. Need... Uh -huh, the past form. The past form. Become. No, no, participate. Participate is the ah, verb. Okay. <laughs> Pass participate. Uh, become? No, no, no. El verbo es participar. Participate. Dígamelo mm -hmm. en pasado. Participate. Participate. En pasado. Uh... Good evening, teacher. In past, uh, participate is 
participated? Yes, yes. All right. Yes, thank you. Thank okay. you, Brian. No problem. It's okay. It's okay, Diana. Don't worry. I'm going to give you another verb, Diana. Diana, the verb is okay. see. See you. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Sent us. The past. Um, the past. The past. Word is so. So. S A. S A W. Yes. Okay. All right. I'm sorry, Jorge. Like the movie. So. Yes, like the movies. The movie franchise. The, the franchise. Yes. There are like nine nine movies or ten movies. I'm not really sure. Yes, yes. Then amazing movies. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Very good. Now that everybody, well, almost everybody is here, I'm going to take attendance. Because I was waiting for everybody, you know. Yes. Let me do it. Ana Victoria Galán. Present. You, Asalia Melanie Portillo. Present, Thank you, Asalia. Brian David Ramirez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Let me let's continue. Carlos Alberto Orrego Monge. Let's continue. Carlos Eliezer Dimas Soriano. Denise Alejandra Zuniga Aldana. Present. Thank you. Diana Yamilet Maravilla Navas. Present. Thank you, Diana. Edith Adilia Hernandez. No, okay, thank you. Ismael Ernesto Poyat. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Ismael. Jorge Ernesto Hernandez. Present, teacher. Thank you, Jorge. Mayra Elizabeth Lazo Escobar. I think she mentioned... Uh, that she's sick, I think. But she's here. She's here. She's here. As a listener, but she's here. Hi. Good evening. I'm sorry, Mayra. Good evening. It's okay. Don't worry. Raquel Elizabeth de la Rosa Rodriguez. Sandra Yves Mendoza de Flores. Present teacher. Thank you, Sara, Raquel, or Rachel Salazar. And Jancy Andrea Solortano Castro. Present teacher. Thank you, Jancy. Okay, very good. People, today we are going to start unit number four. Let me show you the book real quick. And let me show you the objective, today's objective. Unit number four, we begin unit number four. This is the last unit of the book. And this unit is about accounting or accounting, accounting, accounting. Both pronunciations are correct. You can pronounce it the way you, you want it. Again, accounting, accounting. People, what does accounting is? What does, what is, what does it mean? What does it mean? Accounting. And in contabilidad? Yes, exactly, Point exactly, time. yes. Okay, it's about, it's about money, all right? It's about money, contabilidad, yes. We're going to be uh, taking a look or looking at some vocabulary related to accounting. This vocabulary is a little challenging, you know, because, uh, well, in my case, I do not uh, know much about accounting. I know a few things. But I, I'm not, I'm not expert on the area. Look, I will be able to describe the financial activities that my company or someone else's has. The financial activities. We're going to be talking about four financial activities here. You can see them in part number two. Yes, you can see them there. All right. Now, the first thing that we're going to do is this brainstorm. It's a uh, brainstorming group, but no, we're going to do it individually. 
brainstorm in your group about what a financial statement is. Let me go back and let me show you this. Let's let's begin. Let's begin. There is a lot to do today, people, and uh, well, hopefully everything will be uh, okay and uh, we will have no problems. Look, what comes to your mind? What comes to your mind when you see the words financial statement? People, what comes to your mind? What thoughts, what ideas, what opinions come to your mind when you see financial statement? Yes, tell me. Hello? Financial statement. I think it's, um, it's something about account, accounting. Okay, it's something about accounting. Okay. Okay, yes, it is. It is actually. Maybe okay. a report of incomings. Mm -hmm. Okay, a, re a report of incomes. Okay, yes. A report of incomes and maybe outcomes. We will see later on. Yes. People, what else? What else? More ideas, more ideas. Well, let me write down what you guys said. That way we have the ideas right there. Can you repeat what you said, Jorge? I'm sorry? Can you repeat what you, what you said before? Something really, uh, about accounting. Okay, something about accounting. All right. Um, and uh, what do you say? Uh, what do you say, uh, Denise? A report with incomes. Okay, a report with incomes. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, do you guys have more opinions, more ideas, or more thoughts? Hello. Sí, sí, sí. Maybe uh, relacionado. How do you say relacionado? Related. Related. Related to. Or related with. Uh, related to sounds better. Related with money. Okay. Okay. Related to money. All right. Okay. Let me write it down. It is related. There you money. Go. It is related to money, all right? What else? What else can you say? Hello, Carlos? Diane. Deposit, Carlos. Bank, bank deposit. Okay, bank deposits. Okay, yeah, yeah, bank deposits. Accounting report. And accounting. Report. Accounting. Accounting report. Yes. All right. Do you have more ideas? Maybe related with method of payments. Okay, it is related with methods of payment. Okay, more ideas? Uh, maybe um, like a report about the stock. Okay, a report about stocks, yes. Also works, let me put it up there somewhere over there. Report about stocks, okay. A report about stocks. Okay, what else? More ideas? Account statement. Account statements? Yes. Es lo mismo, creo. Es lo mismo. Bank deposit. It's the same, yes. All right. Let's stop here. All right. Financial statements. Yes. It's all about money. People, it's all about money. 
it, what you have said, you what you have said right uh, uh, over here, it's pretty much what financial statement is. Yes, it's all about money. Okay, assets, liabilities, uh, money you pay to uh, shareholders. Uh, well, let's take a look. Veamos. Let me erase this, and let me show you a definition for financial statements or financial statements, if you will. Why is the, the picture blue? My shirt blue, my background is blue too. Why? Why? Everything is blue. I look blue too. <laughs> wow. All right. Rate, rating records that convey the business activities and the financial performance of a company. That is financial statements. Okay. Yes. And in the book, if you go to part number two, in the book, you're going to see four of them. You're going to see four of them. Yes. And we're going to take a look at all of them individually. Yes. Do you know what convey is? Convey. No? Yes? No, teacher. It's it's a synonym for the verb express. Express. In Spanish will be expresar. Or also ver verbalize, como verbalizar. Yes. I was I was drinking some water. Okay, let's continue. Look, these are the four financial statements. Balance sheets cash flows, income statements, and equity. Let me repeat it. Balance sheet, cash flows, income statement, and equity. Yes. Before, before we go and take a look at the definitions, we're going to go back to the, to the book. And over here in the book, we have the same vocabulary. Number one, part number one says brainstorming in your group about what a financial statement is. We did this part already. We're going to continue and move on, on to part number two. It says there, match the different financial statements with their definitions. Compare with a partner. All right. I already read from A, B, C, and D. Okay, cash flow, income statements equity statements and balance sheet. Now, let's go to the number, numbered parts from one to four. From one to four, we have the definitions. Those are the definitions, all right? Those are the definitions and look, let me read them. Let me read them and I'm going to help you with the vocabulary, all right? Reports on the changes in retained earnings of a company during the stated period. Retained? What is retained? Earnings? Earnings? Earnings, ganancias. Earnings, ganancias. Mm -hmm. Retained? Retenido. Yes. Yes, exactly, exactly, exactly. You're right. The second one, I'm not going to help you with the definition. You're going to think about it and you're going to analyze it by yourselves. Look, second one, reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owner's quality at a given point in time. Let me repeat it. Reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owner's quality at a given point in time. What is an asset, you may ask? People, what's an asset? Do you have any ideas? Okay, let me tell you that the word, the word assets has many, many definitions in Spanish and many uses in many different areas. Okay, yes. But uh, I think here, here it means activos. In accounting, in accounting, in this case, it means activos, assets, yes, assets, all right? Let me, let's go back to that part later on. 
let's continue with liabilities. What is liability, people? Any idea? Uh, see you. Exactly. Uh, see you. The, the opposite, the opposite of, of assets. Asset activos, liabilities passivos. Okay. Yes. Now, what is what is what is asset or what is activos, people? Do you know? Do you know? Or do you have an idea? As is all uh, that the company is pro pro proprietary, proprietaria. Own. Son the todos los, los proyectos eh, y bienes que tiene una, una empresa. En términos. Yes, exactly. Jorge is right. Assets are the things or uh, the properties of the company. Yes. Like, for example, if a company has a lot of computers, the computers are the assets. Okay. If they have a lot of cell phones, the cell phones are the, are the assets. Printers, a lot of things, you know. Those are the assets. Yes. Okay. And liabilities, what about this one? It means pasivos in Spanish, liabilities. Or in another area, it can be like responsibilities. Responsibilities. But what is it, people? ¿Alguien, alguien sabe qué significa que, o que son pasivos? Hold on. The pasivos is uh, el... Yes. el dinero. Ay, dicha. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Go. You can do it, you will. Go. Let me remember. Bachillerato. My bachelor. <laughs> Your high school days. High school. <clears throat> lo que la... se mueve. Es lo que se puede mover. Lo que... Lo... Es lo contrario de los activos. El dinero que sí lo podemos pues, palpar. Ok. Ok. Yes. Sí, eh, son todas las, todas las obligaciones que tiene una empresa eh, para las cuales al, al, adquirió activos principalmente. ¿no? Por ejemplo, Exacto. si compró un terreno al, al crédito, ahí hay un activo y también un pasivo porque uno es una obligación por pagar. Exactly, exactly, yes. Fondo. Okay, so basically, basically, uh, the, fondo monetario. Yes, basically, the liability is things the company has to pay. For example, uh, the the internet services, uh, cable services, telephone service, whatever, water service, or all of those things. Or if the company owns money to another company, they have to be paying. Yes. For, for uh properties that they buy or even assets that they buy, etc. All right. Uh, reports on a company's incoming and outcoming of cash, its operating, investing, and financing activities. Let's go. Income incoming is the money you receive. The money you receive. And outcoming, it's the money that goes out. Maybe for investing, I don't know, for Many, many reasons. Summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. Now, maybe you have no questions, people. Hola. Let's work, let's work on this activity. Let's match. Let's match the words to the definitions. Okay. Unamola. Veamos cuál es cash flow, veamos cuál es income statement, and veamos acá. Y luego vamos a verificar si están correctas o no. Okay. People, let's go.
if you have any questions, let me know. Are you ready? Still working? Yes, I think. Okay. Jorge, you ready? Okay. Thank you, Jorge. Oh, my neighbor is great to look today. Can you hear the music, people? <laughs> no, at least the bass. Are you guys finished? Yes, okay. Now, I believe I believe you have the book right there with you. If you don't have it then I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But look, I'm going to I'm going to show you I'm going to show you some description. Now, let's go back to the presentation read. Look, uh the first thing the first thing that we're going to take a look at is the balance sheet. The balance sheet Get ready because we have more vocabulary here. What is what is the balance sheet? Well, I got the definition. Overall financial health of the company includes assets and liabilities, includes equities and give indication about solvency of a company. And that is the balance sheet. Do you have any questions about the, the, the balance sheet? Or how do you say how do you say balance sheet in Spanish, people? Balance sheet. Balance. Hoja de balance. Hoja de balance. Hoja de balance. Hoja de balance. Right. Very very easy. Okay. Um. Uh, well, yes. Hoja de balance is the most important. Estado de resultados que me puede hacer. Estado de resultados. Hoja de balance. All right, that's fine, that's fine. Yes. So, let's continue here. Now, go, go take a look at your book. 
And uh, compare, compare if the definition that you have here is the same as there is in the book, or the same as the, the same that you have that you have chosen. Income statements, income, you know, income when money comes. Business performance of a company, business performance of a company, profitability and liquidity of a company, direct and indirect cost and expenses. This is the income statement. Yes. How do you say income statement in Spanish, people? Income statement. I think estado de resultados. Yes. Income statement. Yes. Income is money you receive. All right. Money you receive. That's the income. Uh, entrada, right? Entrada. That's the income in Spanish. Cash flow, cash flow, cash position of a company gives indication of available cash, planning cash flow for projects and expenditures. That's the cash flow. And the last one is the, 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 the equity. All right, the equity one. Yes. It is shareholders equity, dividend payout, and retained earnings what's a payout people what's a payout pay out pagado i'm sorry pagado yeah yes what's dividend people dividend dividendos no. Yes, dividendos, okay. Do you know what it is in Spanish? Mm -hmm. Oh, do you know what, what it is in accounting? Okay, you're doing something else. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right all right very good very good thank you let's go let's go here let me show you the book again now we're gonna see cash flow can anybody read can anybody read cash flow read cash flow and read the definition as well please anybody okay let me choose a person then. The answer? With the answer? Yes, please. I'm not sure if it's right, but I'm going to say it. It's okay, don't worry, <laughs> don't worry. Uh, cash flow, report, uh -huh. a company's assets, liability, and owner's quality at a given point in time. Okay, you're suggesting that it is number two. Yeah. That's a okay. Oh. Just, you said you said reports a company's assets, liabilities, and the owner's quality at a given point in time. People, do you agree with Denise? No, 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 no. Guys, do you agree with Denise? Denise suggests that cash flow is this one. Okay, let's choose. Let's choose it as correct. Ya vamos a confirmar si es así. Okay, letter A. There you go. I okay. think no, teacher. Okay. <laughs> you took time. You think no? Okay. What do you think is the it is the answer? Number three. Number Reports three. Reports on a company's incoming and upcoming of cash. Mm -hmm. It's operating, yes. investing, yes. and financing yes. activities. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. It is the third one. It is the third one. Okay. This one is cash flow is this one. Oops. Very good. Thank you. Thank you for your participation and for reading. Melanie, read the second one. Income statement, Melanie, with your definition.
Melanie? I'm in t-shirt. Hello. Hello. Yeah, I'm in t-shirt. Number, number two. Number two, reports a company's assets, liabilities, and numbers of quality at a given point in time. Yes, okay. Guys, do you agree with Melanie? Number one, two, or three. She said number two. Okay. Let me tell you the answer is number four. This one. Sorry. Hold on. Okay. Summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. Yes. That's income statement. Let's continue with equity statement. Diana, can you read please that one? Diana? Okay, teacher, number one. Number, num letter C, income statement. Read, read income statement and read the definition that you have chosen. Three. Number three? Yes, Diana. Number three, a uh, report of the company. It's called, it's called um, outcoming of cash. Is operation, investing, um, financing, activity. Okay, so you shows you show the one right next to it. Okay, equity statement. You suggest this. You're suggesting that equity statement is number three, but no, it's not that one. People, which one is the answer? Letter C goes in number one and number two. Number one. Okay, the equity the equity statement is this one. Reports on the changes in retained earnings of a company during a period, during uh, the stated period. So it's letter C. Therefore, balance sheet is this one. Excuse me. There. Reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owners widely at a given point in time. Yes. yes Do you? Miguel. Sí, puedo. Okay. It's okay. Le escuchamos. All right, guys. Do you have any questions? This 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 vocabulary is complicated. I mean, not yeah. the vocabulary, not the vocabulary, the field is complicated, the area, yes. The counting, yes. Yes. No. <laughs> yes. And, and don't worry, people. And don't worry, when you get to advanced level, you see uh, vocabulary that it's difficult to, to understand. Like strange words, difficult vocabulary. Okay. Thank you for your participation. Now let's move on to part number three. On part number three, there are three items I believe that we need to discuss, that you guys need to discuss. So three items. Discuss with a partner the following ideas. Share your opinions and give reasons. It's not so important to know about the incomes and outcomes a company has. Last year, a company's owner fired many people. The owner carried such actions to save the company. Three, it is mandatory for everybody to check in, to check on his or her profit profits to see how much can be invested or spent. Those are the three items that we are going to discuss. Yes, but hold on. We're going to do. What time is it? Okay. It's, it's, uh, Erco, you can be called. Terremoto, otra vez. Espérame, creo que voy a salir otra vez. Sí, 
puede salir. Se vino fuerte. Está temblando. Se Está vino temblando. fuerte. Se vino fuerte. Oh, no. teacher. Let me drink some coffee, wait. What? Okay, ready. ¿Qué pasó? <laughs> Ya pasó. No, no, estuvo, no estuvo muy fuerte, no fue muy fuerte, pero no, sí, sí, se sintió un poquito. Relax, I relax. don't feel, I don't feel it. You don't feel safe? Me neither. No. You didn't feel it? You didn't, no se sintió? Me, no. Me neither. I don't feel anything. The first, yeah, but this, no. Sí, fue, no. fue suave. Fue suave. You're... <laughs> okay. It's your nervous. No, no, sí fue, en serio, en serio. Sí, serio, tembló. Sí. Acaba de temblar. Son réplicas. Sí, yes, exactly, exactly. Son copias. <laughs> All right. Now, well, we have, we have uh, three items. I'm going to give you two minutes exactly for you guys to, to come up with ideas, okay, or, or uh, opinions for these three items, okay? Read the items. And uh, yes, just come up with an idea or, or an opinion about that item. Yes. Or you know what? You know what? Choose only one. Elija uno. Choose only one. And I'm going to ask you about the one that you have chosen. And you can give me your opinion about that specific item. Okay? Better, easier, and faster. You know? Only one. Choose one. One, three, or uh, one, two, or three. Go ahead. El 5.3 fue teacher ahorita. I'm sorry. 5.3. Pero no sé, bueno, aquí no lo sentí mucho. No es como el otro que sí se sintió fuerte. Ah, ¿Dónde vive? En Cuscatlán. San Salvador. Acá es el epicentro, o sea, se siente más fuerte. I'm sorry, you have to, really? uh, you have to sleep with the doors open. Okay. La cosa que está temblando en la noche. And, and you have to sleep with clothes on. Yes. Okay. You know, just in case. Just in case. <laughs> okay. Ready? Are you guys ready? Okay, let me start with the first one. Who shows who shows number one? Who shows item number one? It, it's not so important to know about the incomes and outcomes a company has. Who shows shows that one? Nobody? Okay, nobody did. But do you have an opinion about it? I think yes, it's, yes, it is important to know about incomes and outcomes of our company because uh, we need to know how is the financial of the company. Okay, how the financial situation of the company is. Yes. Okay. All right. All right. Another opinion. It's like um money available. 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 Mm -hmm. Can you repeat, please? Yes. Como dinero disponible. Hmm. Available money. Okay. 
So we, we need to know about, about how much money we have uh, available. Another opinion. No. Now, let's continue with the second one. The second one, last year, a company's owner fired many people. The owner carried such actions to save the company. You know, if you if you if you uh take this out of context, fire incendio, incendio muchas personas. <laughs> but it's not that. Aquí es despedir, okay? Fired, despedir. <laughs> no es incendiar. <laughs> yeah, that's bad. All right. What about this one? Who shows number two? Nobody. Impossible. I'm going to choose a, a person directly then. No problem. <laughs> Let me see. Let me try with uh, with Diana. Yes. Diana, what can you tell me? What can you tell me about the second item? Last year, a company's owner fired many people. The owner carried such actions to save the company. Okay, yes. teacher. Um, a veces son fine action de, de, de necessary. Mm -hmm. uh, even in the uh, house, go to the remove stuff. No sé cómo se dice. Repeat, please. Um, Como quitar personal, um, remove yeah. stuff. Mm -hmm. It's like, like uh, what's the word? Lay off. No, wait. Sí, creo que es. Lay off. Lay off, lay off como recorte de personal. Despedir, pero como recorte. Mm -hmm. Lay off. Yes, teacher. Ok. Acciones necesarias. Ok, necessary actions. Mm -hmm. Acciones. Ok. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Very good. Let me try with with Sara. Sara, the same, the same, the second one, the same one, Sara. Hi, teacher. Yes, the second one. Yes. I don't understand the activity because uh, they are out my internet. Oh. <laughs> Read number two. Leer la número dos y dar su opinión. The reporter a company. El ítem número dos que está acá en la parte tres. Eh, last year. Yes. Last, last year, year, a company's owner fired many people. The owner carried such actions to save the company. What is owner? Fire. Owner, propietario. El año pasado la compañía. Ay, no sé cómo dice. <laughs> El dueño de la compañía despidió a muchas personas. Eh, because the less guard. Sorry? The less gore? O sea, por poco, little gore? No entiendo lo último que dice. Eh, posiblemente porque había poco trabajo. Ah, there was a. Uh, how can I say that? A little, a little work to do? A little work. Okay. I think. Okay, probably so. All right. Uh, let's see. Number three, it's mandatory or it is mandatory for everyone, everybody to check on his or her profits to see how can be, how much can be invested or spent. Ahora sí todo. <laughs> yes. Let's let's begin. Anybody. 
नंबर थ्री नंबर थ्री हेलो एनी बारी सांद्रा यू वर अबाउट टू से समथिंग No, okay. People, no opinions. G give me one minute, teacher. She oh, okay. is looking for in Google. <laughs> I think, I think maybe <laughs> it's not stay pressured. <laughs> Don't right. stress me, teacher, please. <laughs> okay, sorry, um, Denise. <laughs> Uh, uh, in my case, I think it's not man mandatory, but it's important to know not a detail, but something. Because actually, I lived something like that in my last work, mm -hmm. and and uh, every all the bosses say said said like everything is okay, it's alright, and and it wasn't like that. So, okay. Uh, may maybe not a detail, but something to know about the 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 state, the status of the job or the place. I don't know. Okay, I understand your point. Yes, and but you're probably right. Yes, it's not like you don't have to know everything. You know, just a, a little bit is fine. Yes. Okay. Anybody else? In this in this context, uh, profit is ganancia. Yes, exactly. Profits, earnings. Oh. Yes. Okay. Teamwork, teacher. Teamwork. 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 Okay. Teamwork. Yes, exactly. Teamwork. Do you have more opinions about number three? I'm not sure. Um, it's topic about the the profit of personal or in a company. I'm not sure, teacher. I, I must... think personal. It's a it's a personal profit. I think it's is. I'm not really sure. I think it's personal. Yes. Okay, so can be the it's about the you need to spend less than you are. Okay, yeah, you need to spend less. Okay, than you are. All right. Okay, people, thank you very much for your constant participation. And, uh, uh, we're not going to continue with part three. It's part number four now, but that part number four has to be on a presentation. So let me bring you back here. Okay. Look, uh, we're going to study or talk a little bit about so and such. So, such. These are words that we use to um. exaggerate. Not, 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 not to exaggerate, to increase the level of emotion or excitement. Okay, let me repeat it. So and such are used to increase the level of excitement, the level of, uh, well, if it is superior, yes. But let's, let's take a look at it right now. Let's go. The first thing, the first thing that we're going to talk about is how to use so. 
¿Cómo usar ese so? So tiene muchos usos. Yes, it has many, many uses. How to use so and such. So and such are, listen, look at this, are pretty much the same when it comes to meaning. Are pretty much the same when it comes to meaning. Okay. People, what is pretty? Pretty much. Pretty, you say. Pretty. No? Bastante, bastante, muy. Bastante, muy. Okay. Son muy parecidos cuando se refiere a el significado. Their difference, their difference is noticed in the use of grammar. La diferencia se nota en el uso de la gramática. Look, so plus adjectives and adverbs. Adjective is a description. With adjectives, you describe a person, animal, object, or place. Adverb, with an adverb, you describe an action, you describe an adjective and another adverb. Vamos a ver, so happy. People, how do you say so happy in Spanish? Muy feliz. Okay, muy feliz, tan feliz. Okay, like I'm so happy, estoy tan feliz, estoy muy feliz, estoy bastante feliz. So, so happy. This one is pretty simple. It's muy, muy fácil. This one is very, very easy. So happy. The, 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 the president, the president is so happy. The baby is so happy. Mauricio and, uh, let me see. Mauricio and Fernando are so happy, etc. So fast, so good, so important, so well, so fast again. So early, so hard, so easy, so necessary, and so much plus countdowns. But this part is for a different class. Okay. Look, Brian was so happy to see his result. Brian estaba tan feliz de ver su resultado. O estaba muy feliz de ver su resultado. Edith was so angry at her boss. Edith was so angry at her boss. Edith estaba tan enojada o muy enojada con su jefe. Diana speaks so loudly. Diana speaks so loudly. Diana habla muy o bastante alto. Fuerte. Yes, oh, fuerte. Exactly, exactly. Today's topic is so easy. El tema de ahora es bastante fácil o es muy Basically, basically, that so means very. Ese so es otra forma de decir very. All right? Very. There you go. Very happy, so happy. Very fast, so fast. The same, no difference. All right? No difference. Questions about this one? Or do you think this topic is so difficult? Teacher, one question. Yes. Uh, what is what is the difference uh, between so and too much? And too much. Too much. Maybe I... Too much, no. Too. Too. El too, sí. El too, sí. Sí, sí. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Too much. Vamos a ver. I am... I drove so fast. I drove so fast. Manejé tan rápido. I drove too fast. Manejé demasiado rápido. Oh, here is. Excuse me. Uh, Look, there is a consequence. Cuando usamos el to, en cualquier ocasión, indica un problema. Yes. I drove too fast. Dem manejé demasiado rápido. There is a consequence. Maybe this person had an accident. Oh, I don't know. Okay. I drove. Si es so fast, es neutral. Si es, por ejemplo, si digo, I am too happy. Estoy demasiado feliz. No. <laughs> Eso no. I am, uh, vamos a ver acá. The, the, exam, the exam is too hard. El examen es demasiado 
is this key. Okay, yes. The consequence, I will not pass. More questions, people? No, okay. Now, we're going to, this part is easy. This part is so easy, so easy. The other part is a little challenging. This one, how to use such, how to use such. There is a combination of three words. There is a combination of three words. Those three words are four words, actually four. Such a or such an plus a description, which is an adjective plus a noun. The noun is the same as the person. Ese noun que está ahí se refiere a la persona que está mencionada en el en el no lo vemos como dicho. sujeto. No, no está acá, no, pero aquí está un ejemplo. Aquí le voy a explicar. Okay. For example, such happy, such uh, fast, such a good. I mean, please, such a happy, okay, no problem. Such a happy. Such an important, such a brilliant, such a reckless, such a busy, such hard, such a noisy, and such a necessary. Okay, there you go. How do you say such in Spanish, people? Es como comparar con algo, algo así. Mm -mm, no. El so y el such es lo mismo en significado. La diferencia es en la gramática o en las palabras que se usan. Y se usa el so y el such para darle un poco de nivel a lo que estamos diciendo, ya sea de emoción, de tristeza, de enojo, etc. Ok. Ahora, ese such significa tan. Ok, tan. Tan. Ahora. Mauricio is such a brilliant teacher. It's an example, okay? <laughs> Mauricio is such a brilliant teacher. Mauricio es un maestro tan brillante. Todo ha regresado en español, pero así es. Mauricio es un maestro tan brillante. Y esa es la estructura. Mauricio is such a... That's the such a adjective is brilliant, brilliant teacher. Teacher is the noun. Siempre tendría que ir ese, ese, si yo digo, por ejemplo, aplica con el such. Sonia is such a, oh, vamos a ver, the, si yo digo, uh, Sonia is such a delicate. No es correcto decir así. Ok, falta mencionar qué es Sonia. ¿Qué es Sonia? Sonia is such a delicate. Ok, Sonia eh, es tan... Bueno, no tiene sentido. Tiene que poner acá, por ejemplo, woman, mujer. Ok, Sonia is such a delicate woman. Sonia es una mujer tan delicada o muy delicada. Chiquito woman, falta... Uh, algo ahí, entonces no puede, no, no puede decir así uh, o cambiarlo a pilot piloto Sonia is such a delicate pilot, Sonia es una piloto muy delicada All right. another one uh... no. writer Sonia is such a delicate writer Sonia es una escritora muy delicada such a delicate write, writer. Okay. Escritora muy delicada. Yes. Maestro muy brillante. Mr. Orrego has such an important meeting today. Such an important meeting today. Well, how do you say such an important meeting, people, in Spanish? Such an important meeting. Una reunión muy importante. Exactly, a very important meeting, right? Yvette is such a reckless driver, reckless imprudente. Yvette is such a reckless driver. I'm sorry, Sandra. <laughs> okay, Yvette dice, 
es una conductora muy imprudente. All right. Inglés corporativo is such an incredible company. And one more example, Stella is such a hardworking woman. Okay. So you need, you need this combination. Después de such, usamos la A o la A-N, A or N, or maybe nothing. Then we need the, the adjective to describe the person. And we need to mention the person uh, or the profession of the person or anything that, that, that you're applying on that context. Questions, people, preguntas about such. Um, such is for, for, for give more emphasis. Not really. The not sentence. Really. It's the same. It's lo mismo. No. It's lo mismo. Sí, sí, que le da un poco más, no, no, sí, emphasis, but emphasis más que todo al adjetivo. Al adjetivo. Sí. Es como lo que estaba anteriormente con el sol. El sol le da emphasis o incremento al, al, al adjetivo. Yes. The same situation happens here. Es que so y such es lo mismo. La diferencia es en su orden de palabras. Yes. Okay. But don't worry. Look. Don't worry. Let's take a look at the grammar difference. Such or so. You're thinking like such or so. Which one can we choose? So plus adjectives or others. Adverbs. English is so important nowadays. Such a or an uh, adjective plus noun. English is such an important language today. Look at the difference. Es lo mismo en español. Inglés, dice acá, es muy importante en la actualidad o en estos días. Inglés es un idioma muy importante en estos días. Yes. Es lo mismo Solo que hemos usado diferentes palabras o diferente orden o sintaxis diferente. Now, look, so important, such an important language. Such an important language. Now, let me give you more examples. Let's say, uh, I don't know, a woman. Oh, let's write Carla. Carla is... So, let me see, so shy, shy, timido, timida. Carla is so shy. Can you give me the same example but, but, but using such? Can you try to give me the same example but using such? Carla, guys, tell me. Is, hello? Carla is such, such. Uh -huh, such. a shy such shy. A shy person. Okay, person. Person. No is aquí se pueden poner ustedes girl. Woman. Girl. Woman. You can write anything right there. Girl, woman, secretary, teacher, doctor, nurse, friend, etc. Neighbor. Okay. It doesn't matter. The point is to use to use the person right there. So Carla is such a shy person. Yes. Okay. Carla is so shy. Carla is such a shy person. Okay. Another example. Another example. The book. The book is so interesting. The book is so interesting. Okay. This is such an interesting book. This is such an interesting book. Let's continue. I think there is a picture in a photo. Observe it. Look, look. Jack is so nice. 
Jack is so nice. Jack is such a nice guy. The pizza is so delicious. This is such a such such a okay. Such a delicious pizza. Okay, se usa la a. No, no, no sé cómo se usó aquí, pero sí se usa aquí. Está. Such. Okay, yes. Very good. What time is it? Let's go. Let me read, let me read. No, no. Sandra, lea la uno y de la respuesta de un solo. Okay. The cat is so cute. He's orange and white. The cat, that cat. That cat is so cute. Yes, so cute. Okay, thank you. Jorge, read number two. Uh, Andy helps me. Uh, I'm sorry. Andy helps me clean up after dinner. He is such a good friend. Exactly. Andy helps help me clean up after dinner. He is such a good friend. I cannot say so good friend. So, so a good friend. No tiene sentido. So a good friend. Right. <coughs> Excellent. Three. Uh, Anna, read number three. Mr. Johnson, <coughs> so fast, I can't understand her. Okay, Mrs. John Johnson talks so, so fast, I so can't fast. understand her. Yes, so fast. Okay, we cannot use such here. Such fast, no. Okay, no se puede decir eso. Yes. Thank you. Let's continue. Ismael, read number four. The dogs are very happy and playful. They must love the park so much. The dogs are very happy and playful. They must love the park so much. Yes. Thank you, Ismael, for reading. Denise, continue with number five. Okay. Jenny has so funny jokes. I could listen all day. I could listen all day. Jenny has funny adjective jokes noun. So funny jokes? No. Such funny jokes. Such funny jokes. ¿Por qué no usamos la A aquí? Porque tenemos jokes que es plural. Si usamos such A... We're talking about one one thing, all right? If it is plural, we use only such, such funny jokes. Thank you, Denise, for reading. Sara, read number six. Sara? What number? Read number six. Uh, English class is so fun, I love, I love it. Okay, English class, the English class is so fun. I love it. Yes, thank you. Diana, read number seven. I had so a good time at the party last night. Okay, I had such a good time at the party last night. Thank you, mm -hmm. Diana, for reading. Yes. Okay. Melanie, read number eight. Melanie? Sorry, teacher. Number eight. Read number eight. Paul has so, so many mm -hmm. classes this year. Mm -hmm. He is always tired. Okay. Paul has so many classes this year. He is always tired. Yes. Has so many. Thank you. Carlos Eliezer, read number 10. Uh, number 10 or yes. number eight? Oh, ex nine. excuse me. It's number nine. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Matt is uh, such a hard class, but I like my teacher. Okay. Math is such a hard class, but I like my teacher. Okay. Thank you for reading. Jansi, read number 10. 
Jazzy, read number 10. Okay, she's not there. Brian Ramirez. And, uh, I don't know these people. Carlos Alberto Oyente, it says, listener, Mayra is sick, it is, it says Oyente, and Raquel also. Okay, people, what's number 10? The weather is? So bad, so bad today. The weather is so bad today, I can't ride my bike, my bike. Number 11, the birds are? Ya está la respuesta ahí, no worry. So loud, I can't sleep. Okay, so number 12, the truck made. Guys, the truck made. Such, Such a loud. Such a loud noise. Noise. It scares me. All right. Hizo un ruido escandaloso. Istanbul is space beautiful in the springtime. Beautiful. It's so beautiful. Hey. Istanbul is so beautiful in the springtime. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. Borek is space a good a good breakfast food. Guys, such a good breakfast, such a good breakfast. All right, the book is good. I couldn't stop reading it. The book, people, the book is so, so good. good. So good. Okay, the book is so good. All right, let me continue here, and that's it. Yes, let me stop with that one. And uh, right here, I'm going to show you the next thing that we're going to do. Anna, please help me read, Anna. Help me read this one, the examples with so. Okay. It is so necessary for the company. It is so important, important. To check the reports, the projects were so well made, our ideas were so imaginative. Imaginative. Imaginative, imaginative. or imaginative. Okay. It is, uh, it is so necessary for the company. It is so important to check the reports. The projects were so well made and our, our, our ideas were so imaginative. Carlos Eliezer, read examples with such, please. Okay, teacher. It is such a great program. It is such a significant significant mm -hmm. invest investment. Investment, yes. And the report was such a useful to before. The last product was such a big success. Okay, thank you for reading. It is such a creative program. It is such a significant investment. The report was such a useful tool before. And the last product was such a big success. Okay, guys, do you have any questions about so and such? No questions? All right. Look, uh, I'm going to make groups right now. I'm going to make or create groups right now. And in the groups, I want you to do the following. The first thing that you're going to do in the groups is work on part number five. Okay, part number five in the groups. And after you're done with part number five, you're going to continue with part number six, okay? In part number five, you're going to complete the sentences using we, using so or such in the spaces you have down here. 
And after you're done with that part, you're going to continue and you're gonna work on part number six. Part number six says, talk to a friend about the financial, financial statements you pay attention the most. Say and give reasons why it, it is important for companies and you to take to care about them. Okay, you're going to discuss. This is a discussion. Discuss with a friend. Discuss with a friend the financial statements you pay attention the most. Say and give reasons why it is important for companies and you to care about them. People, uh, let's work on this. Trabajemos en esto. I'm going to give you around probably 20, no, not 20, no. Probably 15, 15 minutes. Okay, 15 minutes para que puedan hacer la parte 5 y la 6. Maybe more time. I know, maybe more time. Okay, <clears throat> in the groups. Let me create them right now. I'm going to create. Wait, I'm going to do this manually. I'm making the groups. There you go. Let's go. Vamos, people. Join the groups and I will see you there. Ahí los veo. Or do you have the invitation or did you get the invitation? Thank you. Entonces esa es la tercera. Hola, el teacher sintió el temblor fue el temblor fuerte. Hello, yes. ¿Cómo es? Hardquake. Earth. 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 Ah, Earth. Earthquake. No. Con ese, ¿cómo le podría decir con Z, no? Earth. Earth. Como tierra. La salida es con, 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 el, con la lengua por fuera, así, earth, earth, okay. y luego quake, earthquake, earthquake, earthquake. Ya pensando en el maremoto, hay maremoto. 
Okay, guys, continue, continue working on the activities. Is so. Okay, teacher. <laughs> Number one, it is good to know the cash flow. They are so important. And second, the architect is so a great one. It's a source. A great so. Number two, so. Number three, so number so. four, so number five, by such ah. and five, and six, six, so. so yes, okay. The next part is talk about the financial statements you pay attention the most. You have an answer in your hand. I'm sorry? You have a fly, you know, una, 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 mosquito. Ah, no. A tattoo? Ah, I, was <laughs> joking. I was joking. Teacher. Teacher. It's got a mosquito. A big, a big mosquito here. Big mosquito. A little. <laughs> Don't worry, tattoos are beautiful. <laughs> Yes, I have one here. Really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I have two tattoos. I have a here in my and my feet. Uh -huh. uh, I have twenty-seven. It's a liar. <laughs> it's a liar. Of course, I'm a liar. I'm a man. <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Uh, did you finish the activity? I mean, the uh, part number five. Yes. yes. Okay. Let me see. You can you can read. Can you read one by one? Yeah. Take turns. One. Take turns. Okay. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Um, Diana. Okay. The first one. You the want first is a goal to know the cash flow. Well, they are so so important. They are. They are so important. So, 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 I know. So. Okay. Uh, it is good to know the cash flow. They are, you know, he said it is good to know the cash flow. Solo uno could say they are. So, I, I don't understand that. But they are so. Teacher, so if so. you understand that. <laughs> yes, I understand. But can you say they are? But they are. Solo. Mm. <laughs> yes. I don't know. Right, right. Okay. okay. The second one. R. R. It's just a mic. Ah. The flows. Or the cash. Read the second one. The architect is such a creative woman. Okay. The architect is such a creative woman. Okay. Or, I should have put in a chat from where. Yes. Three. Okay. Uh, number three. Mm. Oh. Um, the wireless internet access is so convenient. Okay. Wireless internet access is so convenient. Number four. Diana. Diana? Number four, uh, all the inconvenience we create uh, are so popular. Okay, all the inventions we created are so popular. Okay, yeah. number five. The computer was so a significant invention. The computer was such a significant invention. Such, right? Yes. And the last one, number six. Uh, checking your financial statement was so difficult before. 
Okay. It's difficult. Well, it's, it's easy now. I have zero dollars. Yes. Sad. All right. You got <laughs> it. You got it. People. Excellent. Now you can continue with part three. All right. Okay. Yes. Excellent. I have to go to another group. I will see you later. Okay. Don't speak Spanish. I'm watching you. <laughs> yes. Di, di y da razones del por qué es importante para las compañías. Yes. Y por qué es de, te, de tomarlas en cuenta o de tomar la importancia. Digamos, el, el que más nos llamó la atención de las de los financial statements. Uh, Maybe we... de... ¿Cómo se dice estos resultados? Es eh, income, st income statements. Income statements. I think yes. it's the most important because uh, it's, it shows the... Utilidad se me ha ido, ¿cómo se dice? I'm sorry. Uh, earnings. Earnings. La ganancias. Yes, yes, ganancias. Oh, ok. Creo que el resultado es el más importante porque muestra las ganancias o pérdidas que tuvo la empresa en un periodo, pienso. Yeah. Um, I think well, the four that we saw are important. Cash flow, income statements, equity statements. I don't know too much about accounting, but Cash flow is uh, the most identificating to me. Cash flow was reports on a company's incomings and outcomings of cash. I think it's very important yeah. because the company is always have a control of a uh, a review of the incomings and outcome outcomings for check the fin financial. So it's very important. Where is the money? Where where's where the money? The money yeah. Where the money goes? Uh, I think it's very important cash flow. Yes, it's all about money. <laughs> In the financial year. Yeah. It's, it's all, all about you money. Can, what you guys can do is the next one, look the following. You can you can mention you can mention only one statement, the one that you think is more important in your in your own personal opinion. Okay. So I was listening to Jorge, Jorge was uh, talking about one and Ismael was talking about another one. Maybe Sarah can talk about another one or maybe the same one, but she can mention or tell you why it is important okay, yes. i'm gonna give you i'm gonna give you guys more time i'll see you later on okay okay see you sure. later. <laughs> 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 teacher no ha perdido teacher yeah i'm sorry no problem teacher i'm sorry i'm here Guys, uh, did you finish? Are you done? Um, yes, teacher. We we finish. You finished? Yes. Part five and six. Yes. Sí, lo 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 off. Eso es despedir. Lo lo off. Yes, laid off. Pero ese es es un es un corte como no sé cómo puedo explicarle por la compañía que está a punto de quebrar o or something. Oh. When the company has no. ah, exactly, exactly. Lay off.
Vamos a ver. Let's see. Compartan de la 1 a la 6. Parte 5. Ok, teacher. The number one is it is good to know the cash flow. They are so important. Ok, it is good to know the cash flow. They are so important. Number two. The architect is so a creative woman. Creative, creative woman. Ok. Uh, si no dan ahí, architect está mal, mal escrito. Archistech. Es que creo que mete la H va a la T. Yes. That's what it is. Ok. Number three, continue. Wireless internet access is so convenient. 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 Okay. Yes. Wireless internet access is so convenient. Okay. The next is all the invention we create are so popular. Okay. All the inventions we create, we created. I created, okay, teacher. Are so popular. Okay. Are so popular. Number five. The computer was such a significant invention. Okay, the computer was such a significant invention. The last one. Checking your finance. Financial. Financial statement was. So difficult before. Checking your financial statement was so difficult before. Yes. Okay. So guys, are you ready? For part uh, number two? Just, uh, just teacher. Okay. Let me see if uh, the other guys are done. Okay. I will take you back to the main session in a couple of minutes. Okay. Give me a moment. See you later. Hola. Sí, sí. Ah. Es un árbol. Tiene un montón, mira, anda por todos lados, parece mapa. What? It looks like a map. A friend told me it looks like a popcorn. A popcorn. Popcorn. Bye, popcorn. I think, I think the branch. Branching grandma. Branch. Branch. Es rama. Yes. Yes. Branch. I think that I think um it was a branch with the uh, holes, holes, the hojas. Leaves. Uh, leaves. <laughs> leaves. It looks like that too. <laughs> I think we finished, teacher. <laughs> okay, you're ready. Leave, okay. Leave so hard. Leave, leave, and leave. Leave and leave. Leave, leaves. <laughs> leave, leave. All right. Then, if you're ready, let me see if uh, is my Alice is ready too. And uh, if they are ready, we're going to go back to the main session, all right? Yes, teacher. Hello, I'm back. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Hello. Hmm? Ready? Yes. Okay, fantastic. Let's go back. Let's go back. Ready for going to bed. I'm ready. <laughs> okay. okay. No, We're ready. ready. Apenas es martes y tienes sueño, no. Ya veo cómo me veo bien mal. Ya me estoy viendo en la cámara. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> All right, let's go back. Lo hacemos. Okay. okay. Okay, hemos regresado, pero no todos. Faltan muchos. We have to wait a minute. Un minuto vamos a esperar.
well, 45 seconds, 44. Okay. I think everybody's back now. Yes. Okay. Todos hemos regresado. Very good. Just to. Okay. Hold on. Sorry. Okay, uh, let me quickly read from one to number six to double check your answers. I'm gonna read with the answers already. It is good to know the cash flow, they are so important. The architect is such a creative woman. Wireless internet access is so convenient. All the inventions we created are so popular. The computer was such, an, such a significant invention and uh, checking your financial statement was so difficult. Now let's discuss part number six. Okay, let me see, let me choose a group. Let me choose a group with Carlos Eliezer. Yes. Carlos, you- Hi, sure. And could you uh, share the the screen? Me? Yes, teacher, please. This one? Yes. And the number one is, it is good to no, know. No, number six, number six. Ah, number six. Parte seis, estamos la parte seis. Ah, okay. Uh, you in my opinion. Please. Okay, teacher. Uh, with Azalia uh, and Anna and Victoria. Okay. Tell me. Ella, ella le va a decir. <laughs> okay. uh, for me, teacher, the finance, financial statement is very important because when we had a project, um, I ha I had I have to see the technical activities in in the finance part in the project. Okay, fantastic, fantastic. Do you have more opinions, Anna, and your group? Yes. Um, okay. As as yeah. Alia, let me <laughs> Okay. It's bad, Carlitos. Carlos is bad. <laughs> it's a man. <laughs> hey. It is important because it provides jobs for many people. Okay. Um, taking for care of the resource, the company, such as avoiding, avoiding. Mm -hmm. Avoiding. Expen avoiding expenses, um, saving energy, and taking care of what we use. Okay. Yes. That's a good one. That's a good one. Thank you, Asalia, for your participation. Carlos, mm -hmm. are you going to add anything else? I think not. Um, yes, teacher. Okay. And for in my opinions, I think so. Uh, uh, it's important, but only uh, I don't know the bosses, the managers, the engineers, but the rest of the staff. Uh, I think is not necessary. Okay, all right, I get it. I get it. Thank you for 
your participation, uh, Melanie, Ana, and Carlos. Let's continue with Jorge. Jorge, you and your group. Jorge is sleeping. Yes. Yes, you and your group. I think you were working with Mael and uh, Sara. Sara, yes. Yes, teacher. Uh, we'll start. <laughs> Ismael Bablan. Thank you, Sarah. You are after me. <laughs> okay. Um, well, we're talking about the financial statements, and I say cash flow is very important because we need to know where is the money, and. What about we are using them? Um, Carlos have an other opinion that I don't know if I need to talk about his opinion. Um, Carlos, uh, Jorge, sorry, you say about income statements, right? Yes. Okay. I, uh, I, this this is important because. Uh, it shows shows how the companies is uh, going to. I mean about the earnings or not earnings in a period, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you going to add anything else? Mm, no, no, teacher. Okay, that's okay, that's okay, thank you. Let's continue with the last group, Diana, Sandra, and Alejandra. Yes. Um, in my opinion, I said that it's important to know about a financial statement because um, you can know, um, teacher, how can I say rentable? Rentable. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> so you can know if a company is rentable. Um, uh, for me as employee, um, I think it's important too because I can know if I have a future in the company or not. Okay. Um, that's my okay. opinion. Okay, in my okay. opinion, teacher, in my opinion, the the financial statement is so important because you in the comp the company can do anything without money. You can pay the invoice and buy a new tools or how do you say con uh, contratar hire 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 a new personal mm -hmm. it's so it's a uh, it's so important okay all right more opinions no no Okay, people, we have we have finished. Okay, yes, this has been such an easy class, <laughs> such an easy class. All right, yes. Let me tell you this. Uh, I think well, quién no se ha quedado aún de todo lo que estamos acá. Yo fui el primero, teachers. Pero si gusta, con gusto. Yes. I Yo think, no. thank you, thank you, Brian. Dígame, Melanie. Yo no. Okay, entonces se queda hoy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Brian, tomorrow, Brian, don't worry. Tomorrow, no. Brian. Yeah. Okay. Uh, people, we're going to repeat, okay? We're going to repeat, I, uh, some people, pero hoy no. Melanie, yes. Thank you, Melanie. You are such an amazing woman. <laughs> 
Okay. That's good. Okay. Thank you. Just for everybody. Sara, Sara se quería quedar otra vez, teacher. Yes, I think so. He likes, no, he likes Sara se quería quedar. No, cierto. ayer me quedé. Really, Sara. She likes to speak English with the teacher. Oh, oh Sara. So happy. Sí, today. yo creo que Sara quiere I quedar. I sleep. I sleep. Everybody stay. Le dije que ten la... more, ten minutes more, teacher. Sí, yo creo Ay, que no. los demás compañeros están de acuerdo con que se quede Sara otra vez. Ah, okay. yeah. oh, oh, yeah. Democracia, democracia, es democracia. Yeah, yeah. Es pura democracia. Bye, teacher. All right, no. Bye. No, le dije, le dije que se quedara a Sara. El viernes creo que le dije que se quedara. Y se hizo, no, no sé, la de los panes y se fue, mire, sí, de repente. Se escogió. Sí, se durmió. Ah, que se quede ahora pasito, y que se quede así. mañana. Así ¿Quién se fue? Se fue? Apagó cámara, mire, y se fue. ¿Quién se hizo la de los panes? Y you, no sé si, lo, si, lo, si, lo, si me escuchó, se lo olvidó, pero se, se fue, mire. Y me quedé el viernes esperando. Y me quedé esperando. Yo sí quisiera decir que es Sara, pero, pero, pero no lo voy a decir. <ríe> no, ¿sabes qué es lo chistoso? Que, que para mí es obligación cumplir los 10 minutos, cumplirlos. Y sin Sara, ¿cómo los iba a cumplir? <ríe> Porque todos se, fue, todos se fueron y le tocaba quedarse a ella y se fue también. Así que me tocó hacer otra cosa, otra cosa extra para poder cumplir 10 minutos. De verdad, dice el trabajo más. Lo dejaron hablando no. solo. Le hubiera But mandado mi plataforma para que me hiciera la tarea. No worry, no worry. Video, no worry. Hubiera sabido, le mando mi plataforma para que me haga la tarea en ese tiempo. Exactly, right? Yes, yes. Ok, people, excellent, thank you. Ok, it's ok to, to, to relax for a while, for a couple of minutes. Vamos a pasar asistencia y luego nos vamos. After that we go, we go sleep. Ana Victoria Galán. Present teacher. Thank you. Asaya Melanie Portillo. Present teacher, good night. Good night. <laughs> Brian David Ramírez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Borrego was there, pero no está, está de oyente. Dice. Carlos Elías Ardimas Soriano. I'm here, teacher. Okay, thank you, thank you. Uh, let me see. Denise Alejandra Zuniga. Present. Diana Jamilet Maravilla. Present teacher. Thank you, thank you. Edith Avilia Hernandez. Present. Thank you, Edith. Uh, Ismael Ernesto Poyat. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge Ernesto Hernandez. Maya Elizabeth Lazo, thank you, Ernesto. Uh, Maya Elizabeth, she left. She was feeling sick, so she went to sleep. Present, okay. Elizabeth La Rosa. Yes, yes, thank you. Raquel Elizabeth Rodriguez. Yes. <laughs> Sandra Ives Mendoza, thank you. Present, teacher. Ah, no, no <laughs> Sara Rachel Salazar. I'm here. <laughs> yes, thank you. And Jancy Andrea Soriano. Solosano. Present teacher. She say I'm here for 10 minutes more. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yes, yes. Así dijo, mire. <laughs> People, thank you. I will see you tomorrow. Descansen mucho, okay? Cuídense. See you tomorrow, everybody. Yes. Thank you. Take Bye. care. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. <laughs> Amimir. 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 <laughs> I mean, bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye everyone. Bye. bye. Hi, Melanie. Hi, teacher. Okay, we have a couple of minutes to discuss your questions about the classes, about the topics, or any question you have about English in general. Uh, today in class? Sorry? 
today in class teacher. So it's so sh You don't understand? ¿No los entiende muy bien? Lo que pasa es que tengo la, la duda. Ok, pregúnteme. So, so significa así. Y so. Sí, es que so tiene. El, el so significa. Bueno, tiene varios significados en uh, diversos contextos. Uh, pero acá en este caso es como decir muy, muy o bastante. Ok, muy. Muy o bastante. Ok, teacher. Es que tenía esa duda, entonces hubo unas que me, me confundí por eso. Ah, ok. ¿Y sus? Such okay. es lo mismo, es lo mismo con palabras diferentes. ¿Cómo? Déjeme que le explique con un ejemplo acá. Pondramos, pongamos acá, the, el examen de exam was very easy. Observe acá, como dice. The exam was very easy. El examen estuvo... O estaba muy fácil. fácil. Usted puede quitar ese muy, lo puede eliminar sin ningún problema y no, no, altera, no cambia nada. El examen estaba fácil. Very easy, le, le incrementa el nivel a, a easy. Usted puede quitar, quitar, eliminar o... ¿Cómo se Replace en español. Replace. Intercambiar, creo. Ok. The exam was so easy. Mismo de arriba. Es lo mismo de arriba. It's the same. The same, the same. No difference. Es lo mismo, solo que usamos otra palabra. Ok. Yes. Y such es lo mismo que está arriba, solo que el orden de las palabras cambia un montón. La sintaxis. Ok. Uh, podemos decir that was. Ese fue. Such an easy exam. Aquí se hace un solo de revoltijo. Porque acá en los primeros ejemplos tenemos el examen estuvo bien fácil. Yes. Todo así como está ahí. Se lee justo como está ahí. El examen estuvo muy fácil. Bastante fácil, etc. Acá no es así. Si yo lo traduzco literal, diría, ese fue tan un fácil examen. No tiene nada de sentido decirlo así. Hay que ordenarlo y sería de esta forma. Ese fue, ese fue un examen tan fácil o muy fácil. O sea, básicamente es lo mismo, el, el so y el such es lo mismo con palabras o orden de palabras diferentes. Okay. Ahora, intentemos, déme un ejemplo con, con so, Melanie. The park mm -hmm. was very... No, con so. Was so big. Mm -hmm. So? Big. Big, ok. The park was so big. Ahora use ese... Bueno, dígame ese mismo, ese mismo ejemplo, pero usando such. Ok. That was... Mm -hmm. That was... So yes. mm, that was, aunque so puede decir que ese es, ese es, ese es, that is, that is such, uh -huh, such, and one. Usamos la A siempre, bueno, casi siempre. Uh, such a, so luego el adjetivo y luego el lugar. A, di, a, di, uh, a big. Such park. a big park. That, that is such a big park. Oh. El parque es muy grande, dice ahí. El parque es muy grande. Lo mismo dice abajo. Ese es un parque muy grande. Es lo mismo. Okay. Solo que el such como que se ve un poquito más difícil, ¿verdad? Con, con, lo, sí. con lo que se usa. Y el so es mucho más sencillo. Ok, veamos acá. Le pondré un ejemplo con el so, usted lo hace con el such y luego viceversa. Uh, the laptop is so fast. 
Ahora usted, transfórmelo o hágalo con such. Con such, ok. This laptop. Ok, dijo this laptop. Push. This laptop. Sush. Recuerde, recuerde ese, ese laptop tiene que ir al final. Al final. Oh. Uh -huh. Sería esta, como esta es. This is. Ajá, this. This is. Ah. Sosh. Uh -huh. Such. Such. Fast. Such a. A fast. Uh -huh. Laptop. Laptop, exactly. This is such a fast laptop. Ok, veamos acá. He runs so quickly. Él corre muy rápido. He runs so quickly. He, he is, is, he is, he ajá, is él is, such, quickly rooms, such a, quickly, quickly room, no, 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 porque arriba no. dice, arriba dice, él es, perdón, él corre muy rápido, y abajo dice, él es, a rooms quickly, Chico. Uh, Or man. Como él es, él es muy rápido. Él es un hombre muy rápido. O él es un chico muy rápido. Mm. Pongámosle acá. He runs quickly. So runner. Quick... Corredor. He is He... such a quickly runner. Él es runner. un corredor muy rápido. Él corre rápido. Él es un corredor muy rápido. Es lo mismo. Okay. All right. Yes. Hey, teacher. A little difficult. All right. It's difficult, yes. Sí, se hace, requiere práctica, 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 práctica. Vamos a la práctica. Sí. <laughs> Dale sí. vuelta a todo. Do okay. you have more questions? No, teacher. Vale, voy a quitar más tiempo. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Melanie. Gracias por quedarse. Entonces. Ahí solo por la plataforma, pero ahí sí. le pregunto. Cualquier cosa que tenga duda, avíseme por, por el chat de WhatsApp privado, sea privado o en grupal ahí. Mande la imagen o mande, me la manda a mí directamente y corregimos. Ok, teacher. Ok. Thank you. Good night. En casa, Melanie, cuídese. Bye, Igual. bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow.